This is the Geneva Shore Report coming to you from right here on the beach. Probably one of the last days we'll be able to get down here, so we need to take advantage of it. Although it looks really nice this afternoon. A little ruffling in the water. Our seagull friends, I'm sure, are around here somewhere. I think they're avoiding us because we forgot their food. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> poor seagulls. But we are here on and wet. It is Wednesday afternoon, October 16th, 2019. I'm Lisa Otto with Jen Lepkowski and the Geneva Show Report. Good afternoon. We are here for the weather and news update for Wednesday and definitely a fall feeling afternoon. It did warm up considerably um, with the wind dying down. That really, really helped it feel warmer. But when you are here on the beach or right by the lake, the wind is very chilly. It I was is. clocking eight miles an hour. I think it's a little calmer than that right now. Yeah, 6.8, eight miles an hour. It's just hovering under 10 miles an hour. So it's it still really a, is a, a bit cold chilly breeze, though. and brisk. So definitely feels like fall. <laughs> right now we have 50 degrees and it feels, well, if you're at the lake, it feels more like yes. 47 degrees. But if you're inland and away from the lake, it does feel like 50, especially when you get a little glimpse of sunshine, yes. which we have had on and off this afternoon, which is more than fabulous. we expected. So that's yeah. great. Yeah, it was great. And then our low tonight will be 34. Winds will continue to die down some. Tomorrow we're going to have some sunshine, a little more than today, and a high of 53 and a low of 34. So some great weather to look forward to. And I believe by Friday it's going to get up to 58. So yes. We have some nice warmer temps to look forward to. And as far as news goes, well, we have a lot going on as always. Um, we had a couple eventful meetings last night that weren't expected to be eventful. So tonight we're very much excited to get over to the Utility Commission meeting and the Piers Harbor and Lakefront Committee meeting. I know at Piers Harbor and Lakefront, they will be discussing the, the roof, the tuck pointing and the windows here at the Riviera Complex. And I'm really curious to see if they agree with the other two committees because right. everyone so far seems to be on the same page. Yeah. So hopefully it's, you know, smooth. And, and if they do agree with the other two committees, <clears throat> then it will go to a special um, city council meeting on Monday night for 5.30 um, for final approval so work can get started. They need to get going on this stuff. They need to get monies where it needs to be. They need to get equipment and supplies or materials. Things need to get rolling to get this job going. So um, a lot of big things in the Revere's future. And other than that, we have some fun stuff going on. We have the awards dinner over at Grand Geneva tomorrow night with Visit Lake Geneva and all the other partners, which will be a great event. We're excited to share that with you. We have fall things going on. Tomorrow is the second to last farmer's market of the season. So get over there, support your local um, farmer market vendors and pick up whatever you can before you can't anymore. <laughs> so we have that going on. Then we have Elkhorn's Oktoberfest yep. this weekend. We of course have the Dan Patch Stables and their um, haunted hay rides and then their kids oh, version and the east troy haunted house oh, yeah. i forgot about that what is it the terror song? um the house of terror yeah. or walk of terror the walk of terror so walk it's of shame. <laughs> walk of terror um other than that the I'm... gsr was delivered today oh, yes so you can go all around geneva lake pick up a hard copy of the paper or you can go to delavan and elkhorn libraries. You can go to Burlington to Gooseberries, um, the Pharmacy Station in Elkhorn, the Dunkin' Donuts in Delavan. A lot of places have it. So, and if you don't go pick up a hard copy of the paper, check us out on Instagram, Facebook, YouTube, and Twitter. And um, yeah. And fall colors are peaking oh, this, week. this week. And the Lake Shiva Fire Department is wearing pink all month in support of breast cancer awareness. So we have a lot of good fun. things going on. Of, yeah, yeah. We have a great community. We do. We're lucky to be here in Lake Geneva. I love it. All right, we're going to end on that note. <laughs> we'll be back tomorrow morning with more weather, road, and news reports. I'm Lisa Otto. John Lepkowski. And the Geneva Show Report. Bye. Bye.